Satanism. Now, I personally experienced this when I was growing up in the richest county in Texas, and I make that point because there were just billionaires in mansions all over the place out in the countryside, and it really got to be a bummer where I wouldn't get hot girlfriends in the town anymore because... I mean, I just thought I was super handsome getting the senior, super, you know, you know, beautiful girl in her, you know, fancy Bentley or Jaguar. But then I'd learn after I was dating her a week or so that that really wasn't the case. I was being recruited into Satanism. And I just was not going to be part of it. Super creepy. I mean, I've repeatedly been there where you're, you're in the woods at a big, huge barn by a mansion and there are people with hoods on and police cars and stuff parked. I mean, out of a movie. That's why I've always told you about this. And they really wanted me because I was real good looking. I was beating up guys weighed 100 pounds more than me uh, who were starting fights. Uh, I was I was a wild man, uh, but I loved God. Big big difference. And they were just trying to recruit me into it because the times I was there, there was not a lot of young people there that I would see at these things. I mean, a few times I'd have to duck off and then walk miles out of the woods. And then a police car pulls up, and what are you doing? And blah, blah, blah. Well, what's your problem? Why don't you go back? And then all of a sudden, you start getting pulled over when you're you know, going to school, and, you're, and, and your older buddy's driving you, and the cops are after you. And again, most police departments aren't into this, but when the Satanists get control, they've got the cops, and the police know this. They know there's certain jurisdictions that are under this control. God help us. We're in so much trouble, folks. We're in so much trouble. And if you think you couldn't shake a stick or throw a stick in the dark and hit a group of devil worshipers in Rockwall, Texas, right in the middle of supposed big Bible Belt, then you better believe in Manhattan. Woo! Manhattan, San Francisco, Washington, D.C., um, Santa Rosa. I mean, it is it is unbelievable. And these people got all the money, all the power. You know, they could have a hundred mistresses. They could have whatever they want, and that's not what they want. They want the thrill they believe they get by being possessed.